Hi, welcome to Juice Bar. Today we're gonna have a celebration. So the celebration is a cocktail by Davis Dercole from San Benedetto del Tronto in Marche, Italy, and it's a really simple cocktail. A Negroni variation served straight up with a great name. Let's mix it. We're gonna start in our mixing glass with what will be the only difference in the building from a Negroni, which is two dashes of orange beaters. Then we go on with, uh, let's open the Antica Formula, our sweet vermouth, and we're gonna have a uh, equal parts of everything and it's gonna be so 30 milliliters of uh, antica formula red sweet italian vermouth then 30 milliliters of campari italian red bitter And then we finish with 30 milliliters of cognac. This is the other difference from the Negroni, where instead of cognac we have gin. I'm gonna use the Hennessy. Pretty cheap, but decent cognac. Anyway, I think the more subtle flavor of the cognac are gonna get killed by the combination of Campari and uh, Sweet Vermouth. Let's get some ice. As I'm gonna use this big block of ice, I'm gonna get it wet to help with the dilution process. Otherwise, it's gonna take too long. And then we stir this a bit. Of course, having a great name like Celebration makes every everything better. Especially being connected to a festivity helps a lot. Like every Christmas song ever made, being connected to Christmas makes it sure to be replayed over and over. But there are some more subtle connections between song especially and other time of the years which I will get in as soon as I'm done stealing this. I think now it's pretty chilled. Let me have a Right. Mm. 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 Let's strain in our coop. And then let's garnish with some orange. Let's express it. Let's drop it and we are done. A celebration. Cheers. Mm. This is just an excellent drink. I think actually the two drops of orange bitters are essential. I always feel like the brandy cognac have a bit of an orange leaning flavors and uh, I think it combines excellent with the cognac. This is great. I mean in some way closer to a Boulevardier than to a Negroni as uh, we use an aged spirit in oak. Of course, the Boulevardier is just like a Negroni, but instead of genius, Bourbon. And this is just really nice. As an aperitif, as an after dinner. It's fresh, it's spicy. All the good things about a Negroni, just in a different key. 
also not too strong compared to I don't know a martini good amount of vermophile campari lower slightly the alcoholic level oh boy this goes down really fast I like those um, firewood nodes that the cognac brings it's an excellent drink so if you enjoyed the video please like subscribe comment down below share with anybody you like and don't like steer yourself a drink and hopefully I will see you next time cheers So for some of the less obvious connection between time of the year and uh, particular songs, to me one of the best songs that comes back every year it's uh, Summer Dying Fast by Cradle of Filth. Here in Tokyo at the end of the summer, which will be like late September, it's still hot but it's giving up a bit. You will go to any park and you will hear like a car of uh, cicadas all singing really loud at the same time i always feel uh, the need to go back to that uh, credit of filth song summer dying fast which is a really great song from their first album it has everything it's fast it's violent he has a great melodic end with a great bass riff love the summer dying fast